everybody. It's John with Upstate Brush Control. We're back here up on our mountain job. We got to some forestry mulching uh, last week or so. And we were got, you know, it's just one of those things where you don't want to lose any more work. People are like, oh, uh, can, when can you get to me? So I was like, I better do it now. This job isn't as big a rush, but um, we're back up here on the mountain job. Anyways, long story short, we're up here, we're working on the house pad. We got, uh, I'm on the 130. Yes, it is our machine. I did not take the stickers off when I bought it from the rental company. Several people commented and said, it's not yours, you rent it. The dozer is my brother's. The dump truck is my brother's as well. We are hogging out, kind of just scraping off the top of this mountain here, basically. We ended up taking about five feet off and just leveling it out. There's a real bad sun glare. I'll show you in just a minute here. Um, but there's an awesome, awesome view up here. But, uh, so, me and Josh are up here. Josh is dozing it off. Uh, and he's packing. We got Lane. He's wrapping up. A, or, I'm sorry, Willie is wrapping up another job moving the equipment over here from the mulching job we just did and we got our buddy lane uh he's been helping us out a little bit uh just trying to get caught up with some stuff uh, so he's gonna be helping us today but that's what we're doing I'll try to spin you around. I mean, it's it's bad. It's sun. Sun is. We'll, we'll try it. So here's the pad. We're kind of just trying to build it out farther that way. We got the mountains over there. Kind of a 360 view here. Fence guys are working their way around.
the reason why I load in the truck and only backing it up like 60 70 feet is faster than trying to pile it and push it uh, it works really well but here's what kind of what we got this is the pad area where the house is gonna go um so all this we cut it was probably about five feet down to the top maybe six feet we just dropped it down pushing it out that way pushing it out over this way you can see the original grade right there you know so it, it kind of just rolled up slowly and then rolled back down so we're basically just taking the top of the hill cutting it off pushing it out here here's our driveway we put in uh that's we did that a while back or a week or so ago so um i'll show you that later but we still got to touch up some areas on the slope here but it's kind of give you the idea of it um got willie and lane down there unloading the mini so yeah pass you off to josh he'll be packing and uh filling
All right, we're making our way uh, across the cut here. We got uh, Willie's back with his kiss here. Lane is on the roller and Josh is still on the dozer. So we're in this last little bit, kind of in this corner. And uh, oh, let's see here. Try that. So I'm just gonna start bailing it out over there. We don't need to load it in the truck. Uh, so this is just gonna be used right directly behind us. Josh is uh, stripping off some of the topsoil over here real quick so we can fill in that area. I went deep right here and uh, right, right beside me right there because there's a bunch of rock trying to go deep in the rock areas and then we'll put a little bit of dirt back over because he's just going to plant grass over this for now and then um, let him get that topsoil off first and then uh Oh, cause it's gonna be a while before he ever built, before he builds his house, maybe a year or two, something like that. So he's just gonna plant some grass up here. bonds better you know and go a little bit farther that way oh, oh. 